knew this was coming, Pete. Listen to me. I didn't kill your father. What's with you guys, anyway? It's complicated. Peter Parker, Peter Parker, Peter Parker. Shut up, people. We're wearing my name out. I don't need this shit. You know, you want to call me? You got something important to say? Give me a call. You know, I can't be, you know, all the time with this Peter Parker shit, you know? It's driving me nuts. You want me something important to say? You gotta, very, you gotta know what you're saying already. You, you know, that's it. so much. Should I ask you to marry me? Should I not ask you to marry me? Fangul. Let me tell you something. Once once you bang a girl on a spider web, let me tell you something. You do not go back. Okay? What, what do you think? Are you going to go back to cotton sheets after that? Let me, no, let me tell you what you say to cotton sheets after you bang a girl. Especially a girl like Mary Jane. After you bang a girl like that in a spider web, let me tell you what you, from thence on in, what you say to cotton sheets. Sayonara! Sayonara, cotton sheets! Right? Yeah, bet your ass that's what you say. You know, because, I mean, there's just, there's no comparison. I mean, that is like the highest level you can get. That does the spider web get on you a little? Of course it gets on you. It's dirty, you know? It's good like that. You're a little dirty set. What, do you want everything to be clean and perfect? No, you want a little of that dirt and that dust and this webs crawling on you. It just adds to the experience. So yeah, you want to continue to do that. It's a good thing. Do I want to marry her? Do I look like I want to marry her? No, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to play it out here and stop being the tough guy. I do love her. I do love Mary Jane. And I do want to marry her. But there's a problem. What is that problem, you ask? The problem is I have another identity. Spider-Man. That's what they call me. And I can't just, you know, ignore that fact. I mean, it's a fact. I can't ignore it. So I gotta make a decision here. I mean, if I tell her I'm Spider-Man, this could throw in a whole, like, problem because she's in love with Spider-Man, too. And I don't want her cheating on me with Spider-Man, even if I am Spider-Man. I'm, I'm the jealous type, you could say. Because if she starts cheating, then I know it's the Spides that she wants. The Spideys. And I can't be having that, you know. So... You know, what I'm saying basically is, I mean, there's another problem too. I mean, these bad guys are always after me, trying to kill me and stuff. So when they see, like, you know, I got this girl that's really hot and you can bang her in spider webs, they're all on that shit, you know. They want to just take that away from me to try to get me. And they want to, like, they, they know they can't catch me because I'm so fast on my spidey webs. I'm like, Bzz! and I'm like, shh, Ow, and I grab the buildings with the webs and I pull myself in and, and they know they can't compete with that if I'm just running. So they have to take something from me, like my little spidey hoe that I'd be banging in the spider webs. So they take her from me and then it's like, you know, you know, I gotta go after them. And it's different because these guys are like really strong, these bad guys, like it's these like tentacles that like flap around and and you know, they fly and stuff and you know, it's one thing if I'm running from them, but I gotta chase them, and I gotta use my spidey webs and go after them, and it's like, bzz, bzz, and it's like, you know, it's ridiculous. So, I try not to get in that situation, because then I'm like, you know, uh, I don't even want to know. So, I'm still torn, and I, so, you know, I hope to answer this question in Spider-Man 4, and will I actually, will I actually go through with the marriage, have the wedding and all that, or will I just keep, you know, plowing her in my spider web? I don't know. You know, to be honest with you, I, you know, I don't really see the need to go through with the marriage. I mean, I'm still getting everything I need from her right now, but I might end up doing it. I have a soft spot and, um, I don't know yet. I will, I will, I will, I make you this promise. 
I will try to address the issue in Spider-Man 4. I still got fucking James Franco hassling me about whether I killed his dad, too. I mean, we're talking four spider, three Spider-Mans. Well, the fourth one was still going to have this problem. But three Spider-Mans, this guy still doesn't believe that I actually like his dad. I, I like the guy. We hung out together. We played tennis. I mean, and when he died, I, you know, I didn't want to kill him, but, I mean, he was going to kill me. So I did. I was sad when I found out it was him, and I didn't really want to kill him. So I, mean, I didn't really kill him. He kind of killed himself attacking me, and he was really another person. He wasn't really Willem Dafoe at the moment. Once I realized he was Willem Dafoe, I didn't want to kill him anymore, and I just wanted to kind of hang out with him, but he was already dead, so I laid him down, and then James Franco comes in and thinks I killed him. Stupid, ridiculous. I mean, why would I kill him? And I'm laying him down, you know, but he can't seem to accept that fact. So he's going to keep trying to come after me and stuff like that, so we'll see. I mean, I haven't, you know, I haven't seen Spider-Man 3 yet. I'm too busy making it, but so I don't know if, like, if he came to terms in the movie but, in, I mean, in, he might have thought in the movie that it was okay now and I didn't do it. But that doesn't matter because in real life, he still thinks I killed his dad. And I'll tell you this, Jake Willem Dafoe wasn't even his dad. That's how messed up the situation is. James Franco is just messed up. I mean, he thinks I killed some other actor that isn't even his dad. Yeah, it's going to be tough to handle this, so I don't know what I'm going to do. Now I gotta think about marrying someone who I plowed a few times in a couple of spider webs, and now I gotta commit? That's ridiculous. Why do I have to be under this kind of pressure? Everyone else just does their own thing, you know? I mean, shit. I gotta be like the good guy that marries everyone that I bang in a spider web? No. I'm not falling for that. I'm sorry.